und willkommen zurück bei Let's Play The Walking Dead 400 Days. 400 Tage. Letztes Mal haben wir uns mit dem Winz beschäftigt. Jetzt ähm, machen wir weiter. Mal mit dem Mädel, oder? Machen wir mal mit der Shell weiter. Gucken, was da für ein Schicksal hintersteckt. Du, du, du. Red Steiner. Hm. Sieht aber auch schon kaputt aus, oder? Du, 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 du. Shell. Tag 236. Ach du Scheiße. Michelle, hey your sister's getting pretty good, huh? Becca had a good teacher, Steph. Thank you for doing that. She needs something to focus on besides, you know, everything else. Yeah. Growing up in a world like this, what do you think that does to a kid? I don't know. I know it's changed me, well, all of us, but... At this age, for her, I don't know. Becca's a good kid. These are shit times, and she's gonna go through that. But if we can keep her from experiencing some of the shit I've seen... Thanks, Stephanie. Thanks. Becca, that was great. Thanks, sis. You think we can do something like this every week? That sounds like a great idea. Maybe we can all get in on it, like some kind of weekly talent show. That was amazing, Becca. We could all use a little more music in our lives. Did I ever tell you that I used to play in a band? Yes, Roman, you've told us. She doesn't want to hear about it again. All right, all right. In that case, let's get back to work. Oh, and thanks to Boyd's hard work on the vegetable garden, we're having fresh soup tonight. Okay, let's get to it. You want to help me and Shell do the supply inspection? Cool. You check the flashlights this time. I'll look over the guns. Uh-uh. I don't want you messing with those unless we're in danger, okay? I'll take care of those later. Fine. Shell, when you get a sec, meet me out back. Help me feed the watchdogs. Sure thing. Oh, oh, oh. Ah, hier haben wir schon ein bisschen mehr Spielraum. Können wir mal aus dem How's Fenster Joyce gucken? Today? She seems good. Clive's watching over her, as usual. Oof. Talk about survivors. Those guys have been through a lot. Eesh. These knives are looking pretty ragged. Don't worry. They're on our list. How are we doing on ammo? Better than we thought. We haven't had to use these for a while. You guys need help? Nah, we got this. Right, Becca? You go ahead and help Roman out back. Huh. Still one short. We never found the other flashlight? Nope. Still in the cornfield somewhere, I guess. What did Roman want? I don't know yet. Are you gonna find out? Yeah, in a sec. Yeah, in a sack. The diner looked pretty nice back then. That's because they used to pay people to clean it. Also, not as many dead visitors back then. <laughs> Looks weird in here without the paintings. Well, Boyd wanted something to paint his own pictures on. I guess it'll be a personal gallery in here when he's done. Okay, also ein Maler in der Runde. So, haben wir jetzt alles uns angeschaut? Was sind anzuschauen, ja? Das? Blutfleck? Did you ever find out what happened there? No. Roman said it was like this when he and Stephanie found the place. Could be anything these days, though. Still, better not to think about it. Mm -hmm. Ach, da ist eine Lücke, habe ich gar nicht gesehen. 
Hey, Becca, think we should start charging for the inspections we make? Oh, yeah. Then we can spend all our money at nowhere. Dann wollen wir mal. Also besonders sicher sieht das ja hier nicht aus. We should do an inspection on these. Make sure they all work. Inspection, also die leben hier ihre Inspektion, kann das sein? God, what I wouldn't give for a cup of coffee in the morning. Hm, ich habe auch endlich mal eine getrunken. Ich habe schon Kopfschmerzen gekriegt, also... Also durch Koffein wird das ein bisschen besser. Ich weiß nicht, ob das schon Entzugserscheinungen meine sind. Worked in a long time. Aber wahrscheinlich liegt das einfach nur an der absolut schlechten Luft hier in diesem Raum. Smells good. Smells good. Was haben wir hier? Waschbecken. Glad we thought to bottle our water before it ran out. Hmm. Ooh, starting to thin out in here. Thank God we have a garden now. That's natürlich dann praktisch. I don't miss going on raids for this stuff. Banana. Was steht da? Banana. Eingelegte Bananen oder sowas. Uah. Oh, you scared me. He's hungry. Guess he knows it's feeding time. It's not an animal, Roman. Well, it's not human either. Not anymore. You know, uh... Your sister said she wouldn't mind doing this. Roman, we've talked about this. Becca doesn't need to deal with this kind of thing. Listen, I know you think that giving her an easy life is what's best, but it's really not. Hmm. I know, I just want her to have a little more time to be a kid. As long as she knows how to protect herself, it's fine. I don't want her to stop caring about people. Okay. What's that one eating? I don't know. I'll check it out. I gotta get back out front. Looking forward to that soup. Wieso habe ich nur ein ganz komisches Gefühl bei der Sache? Aber was ist der denn da? Oh. Okay, der will nicht reden. Was ist das? Hä? Hä? Was ist das denn? Das sieht aus wie ein Teddybär. Aber ich glaube nicht, dass äh, irgendwie ein Teddybär aus Fleisch und Blut oder was. Ich gehe mal einen großen Bogen. Ich weiß nicht, wo der andere war. Hä? Da ist er. Gut. Gehen wir mal wieder rein. Ah! Oh mein Gott. <lacht> oh, Jesus, don't ever fucking do that again. Whoa, what's your problem? I do this all the time. You don't get all pissed off. I'm sorry. It's it's just the watchdogs. I guess they found a a puppy. A puppy? Yeah. I guess it just got to me. You know, it was it was so little. You don't think about babies anymore, but after a while you just kind of accept this is it. Yeah. I guess you kind of forget. <laughs> right? But then, you know, there it is. You see it and you want to protect it and and now it's gone. That sucks. Maybe if Clive dies next, we can put him out there instead. He'd make a better watchdog anyway. Becca. Becca. Shell, Becca! Something's going on outside! What is it? I don't know, something bad. We gotta find Roman. Where's Roman? If I knew where Roman is, I could maybe help, but... Hmm. Come here, everyone! Shit! Come on, we gotta find Roman. This month, 
Jesus. 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 Largum. My God, Largum. what did you do? All I did was put on the blindfold and bind his wrists. Somebody else beat him up. He already had the cuts and bruises. Watchdogs caught him trying to steal supplies. Is he bitten? No, they didn't get that close. Mm. What did he take? Food, medicine, whatever he could get his hands on. Usual stuff. I couldn't get any other information out of him. I don't think he speaks English. I can't believe he just snuck this is in. The second break in we've had in the last couple of weeks. Last time we couldn't catch him. And they got away with more medicine than we could afford to lose. Well, we all know what it's like trying to survive out there. He just came in here for food. Let's just give him some and send him on his what way. What if there are more of them? He could have been scouting. That's right. He could be part of a larger if group. If there were more, I think we would have seen them by now. I mean, nobody travels alone by choice anymore, right? We can't take the risk of letting him go, but why not let him stay? I guess that would be okay. We could always use more hands keeping the place secure. Boyd, we don't need any more people here. And look at him. How is he he gonna... can't even speak English. This group works because we know how to communicate. <sighs> <sighs> We can find a way for him to help. Well, he's not staying here. You let in a stranger, and everything starts breaking down. The last time we did that, we lost Bree. And then Vernon with that goddamn boat. Vernon and the boat are the reason the group fell apart. Not trusting strangers. Vernon? We stole their boat from that teenage kid at gunpoint. That's when our group fell apart. He can't oh stay here. I agree. Keeping him here is not an option. In his condition, he'd be a drain on our resources. Look, we all know what we're talking about here, so let's stop dancing around it. We either let this guy go and take our chances, or we kill him. Jesus Christ! Are you serious? Roman's right. It's gotta be one or the other. We're letting him go. It's the only right thing to do. I'm telling yeah. you, we can't do that. But killing him? Is that really the answer? Stephanie, boy, you two don't think we should kill him. We know where Joyce and Clive stand on the subject. You're the swing vote here, Shell. What's it gonna be? Yeah, natürlich, nicht umbringen. We have to set him free. We can't. He's not even armed. We can't just kill him. This isn't in self-defense. Isn't it, though? If it means he can't come back to hurt us? That isn't the same thing. But last time... Joyce, that was a long time ago. If we kill this man, then we're giving up a part of ourselves that we can never get back. I'm not ready to let that go. Eben. Er tut's jetzt trotzdem, oder was? Cut him free. I hope you guys know what you're doing. Oh, what do Give him some food. Mein Three or four cans. Just as a gesture of good faith. And get him out of here. I don't know if you can understand a word I'm saying, but you better understand this. You came this close to death today. And if you ever, ever come near this place again, or tell anybody where we are, you wish you had died today. Okay. Oh, das war's schon. Guck mal, dann reicht ja... Ne, Moment, geht weiter. Tag 259. Das ist wahrscheinlich ein paar Tage später oder ein Tag später. Do you have any fours? Nope. Do you have any sevens? Yep. I miss playing guitar for everyone. It was stupid, but fun. Why don't we do that anymore? Since the attack, there's a lot we don't do anymore. We shouldn't have let that guy go. Boyd Just... would still be alive and everything would be the same. Boyd agreed it was the right thing to do. Anyway, Roman's obsessed with keeping this place secured now. 
You know that's impossible, right? Well, after last time, Roman isn't taking any chances. Then he should fix the loose board behind the storage lots. Becca, are you sneaking out again? Did anyone see you leave? No, no one saw me. You've got to stop doing that. You're going to get us both in a lot of trouble. I don't see why it's such a big deal. We had another break-in just last month. Uh, Becca, you know what it means if someone were to see you and follow you back here. No one is following me. There's no one else out there. Shell, I need to talk to you. It's open. What's going on? Hey, Becca. Hey. When you uh, get a sec, I need you to come out and talk to me. It's important. Okay. I'll be outside. You'll see me. Give us a minute. Yeah. Just don't take too long. What was that all about? I don't know. Probably not good, though. Stay here. It'll be just a minute. I'll fill you in when I get back. Also es wäre ja schon mal ganz äh, interessant zu erfahren, was wäre, wenn ich mich dafür entschieden hätte, den umzulegen. Aber, nee, also so hätte ich mich in... Wenn, How come no one's watering these? wenn ich wirklich in der Situation gewesen wäre, hätte ich mich auch nicht dafür entschieden, glaube ich. Aber man weiß es nicht. Es ist immer sehr schwer einzuschätzen. <lacht> 